This training will cover how to use My Write Smart for our district prompts. Begin by logging in to your HMH account and the dashboard will appear. The first thing that you're going to do is click here on Settings and select Manage Classes. Once you select that, then you're going to get a menu off to the side. If you have not set up a class so far, then you need to start off by doing that, entering a class name, the period, and the grade level. Once you've added your class, then you need to add students. So I'm going to click on Add Students. We have a class already set up, so I'm going to click on that one. Now this is important. When you're ready to add students, you're going to select this button right here where it says One Login and Password. That's because our Help Desk system has already added all of the students at the high school into the database. Once you have all of your students added, now you're ready to make an assignment with that writing prompt. So under this drop down menu where it says Assignments, I want you to click there. Once you click Assignments, this menu will appear. I want you to then click the second tab where it says Assignments. Now you need to make sure that you're at the name of the class, which for mine I just named it Test Class, the correct book, um, and then this is the most important part. Where it says Tests and Quizzes, I want you to hit that down arrow, and you are looking for Performance Tasks. Once you hit that submit button, then you're getting all of these choices of different writing prompts that you can assign. We want the create a custom prompt, so I'm going to hit assign. And then you get a window that looks like this. Um, you need to start off by giving it a name. So I'm going to put test prompt 2. I can add a note, please do the prompt. All right. Um, I, have an, I, I can make a choice on how long that I want it to be available for the students to be able to do. I can assign it to all students or certain individuals. You want to make sure that you do enable turn it in because that's what's going to give you that rubric score at the end. You can decide how many times um, how, those, how those scores are going to be reported in a student report. Uh, do you want the students to be able to view their score? So you have some choices there as well. When you're totally done, then you're going to hit Submit, which is down at the bottom. And it's telling me that I can't make the assignment because I don't have any students in my class. Obviously, you guys will. And then it will appear. Once you've made that assignment, then you're going to go back to your dashboard, and then I want you to click on My Write Smart. Once you click on My Write Smart, then you're going to notice that the assignment that we've come up with where it says Create a Custom Prompt now appears. Now over here under the Edit Prompt, you're going to select that and this is the point where you are able to type in and add your own prompt. In our case, this is where you are going to add the Smekins prompt that goes along with your grade level. Just simply copy and paste it into this window. When you're done, then you're going to hit that Save All Changes, and then it will activate the changes that you have made. And that is basically it. Then you're ready to have your students take the prompt.